Hello, my name is Michael Whiteside. I'm an Applications Engineer here at Alleycat Scientific. In this video, I'm going to be showing you the various ways to set an IP address on the front display of an Alleycat device. Now let's get started. Alleycat devices configured with Ethernet IP or other Ethernet-based industrial protocols will require an IP address in order to distinguish the device from other devices on the network. To adjust these settings, we will go into Menu, Advanced Setup, and COM Status at the top here. We see it is configured for Ethernet IP, and it is currently waiting for the network as it has not been connected to a PLC or a computer. With that being said, we can still adjust the address source at the top here. We see we have three sources, a static address, DHCP server, as well as web server configuration. If we first start with static address, hit set. We can define a subnet mask at the top here and confirm that. And then we can assign a static IP address and we will hit set. Now changing the address source to DHCP will allow the device to accept a dynamic IP address using DHCP. Changing the source to our last source here, web server configuration will allow the device to communicate over the Alleycat embedded web server to adjust the IP address as well as other configuration settings. And this can be done by simply typing in the existing IP address into a web browser. And that is how you adjust your IP address as well as communication settings on an Alleycat device. 